Okay. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> oh, that is heavy. Ooh, baby! Ladies, ladies, and gentlemen, this is Amber coming to you with the Frag View, coming to you with another video review. And today we have a massive SAS haul. Okay, and if you don't know what SAS is, bath and body work, honey. We have a SAS haul candle edition. All right. So if you're interested in seeing from Bath and Body Works, what did your sis pick up? Candle style. Just keep watching. Hello, family. Welcome back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back, family. Hey, and if you're new to this channel, my name is Amber, and on this channel, we review fragrances and body care, and we spill some a little tea from here and there. Yo, sis may go left. Mm -hmm. But that's okay. Just subscribe, give it a thumbs up, comment down below. We'd love to get to know you and meet you. And hey, family. Hey, hey, brothers, hey, sisters, hey, aunties, cousins, grandma, grandparents, uncles, mama, papa. <laughs> I hope you all are doing well and fantastic, okay? Hey, new family. I am so glad you stumbled across our family, this channel, and I hope that you just just take a chill pill, relax, stay a while. Just just hit that subscribe button while you're staying a while, okay? And, and that mo notification bell so the bell pop up, and then you know next time I do another video. Anyway, let's get into it because you know how y'all sis is. Mm -hmm. You know. So let's get right into what I have picked up, family. Have you all participated in the Bath and Body Works SAS sale? Have you all participated this year? Or did you sit back and was like, not nah, sis, team too much. I already been in my bag. I wasn't about to do no SAS. Okay. I've been having to say I've been doing a sales the entire year. Okay. It's been SAS the whole year. Are you one of those? Or did you participate, okay? Either way, comment down below. Would love to know, did you dibble and dabble or did you not dibble and dabble, okay? But yo sis dibbled and dabbled, clearly. Um, <laughs> so I have vanilla patchouli, okay? And I have not smelled these candles. Some of these are a blind buy candle purchase. Is there a such thing? Yeah, I guess there is a such thing as a blind buy purchase candle. Mm -hmm. We're going to make that a thing. Okay, well this, let's see. I love vanilla, but I was scared about the patchouli. Hmm. Oh. Okay, this smells like a um a vanilla patchouli fragrance. Uh-huh. Just with the, mm-hmm. Yep, 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 yep. So if you like patchouli, you would probably love this if you do not like patchouli nor vanilla. Don't pick that up. Okay. Because it's, it's in the name. Don't, don't, don't pick this up. But this is cool. But it also seems like this might be light. But we'll see. Okay. So fragrant notes. We have sweet vanilla. Hmm. Patchouli Italian bergamot. Hmm. And cedar wood. Okay. Maybe a little brightness. I don't know, it's very light. So we will definitely have to burn and I'll have to come back with my thoughts, all right? And next we have, which scared me, honey. Aloe and palm, now I did. And I did smell this one, I will say, okay. I did smell this one. And this one make me, uh, it's on its way. Let's just say that, mm-hmm. Add to cart, it's on its way. Mm-hmm. Amazing. And this is what I want for the summer, okay? I feel like this is like on a luxe beach. I feel like vacation vibes. I feel like the the ocean and the waves and the water is just, just going, okay? Like, I... Y'all know how I like ocean. Okay, the Goya, the Joya. The Goya, 
Mm-hmm. When it's in front of me, I, I'm able to read the words. But anyway, <laughs> Ocean de Goya de Joya. Mm-mm. The C note, you know, the, the salty note, the aquatic note, y'all already know. This gives me that. It gives me all of that. So if you like an aquatic feel, you would probably like this. So notes, we have fresh palm leaves, clean eucalyptus, vetiver woods. So, and I just need you all to go past that. Maybe pass all those notes. It is definitely, okay, it gives me clean, but it definitely gives me like a fresh ocean type of luxury. I love this. Uh, clearly, it's already added to cart. There's another one on it. Now, what is on this packaging though? What, what is that? Is that a part of the box? Mm-mm. A mess. Moving on. Next, I purchased some of the mashup collection. And honestly, a lot of people been talking some talk about this. And this, this is not um, a favorite of people. So, was kind of scared. But I still wanted to get it because it's limited edition. So, I'm probably not going to get this mashup again in a candle form, right? So, I just decided to go ahead. I mean, it was $10. And I mean, I did have my 20% off coupon. So the math was mathing. And I made it make sense. And clearly, cha-ching, it's right here. Okay, anyway, you know how I am. Um, so watermelon and lemonade and eucalyptus mint is this one. Let me smell it. Okay. I mean, I definitely like the watermelon, the mint though. The mint's throwing me off, I'm not gonna lie, right? Mint's throwing me off, but maybe when we burn this, it might bring it back all together, okay? So notes we have watermelon ice, Meyer lemon, and crisp eucalyptus, okay? Again, I smell the watermelon, which I like, but the mint is throwing me off. It's kind of making me it's making me think of a cocktail, but that they added mint to, almost like a mojito, like a watermelon mojito. That's what it's kind of, it's kind of giving me, okay? You know, because I think like if you had a watermelon mojito, I think mojito, If I'm, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think mojito has mint in it and they um, mash it, like they, um, Mince it, is that what it's called? When you're mashing and it's the mint. It, uh, all you mixologists, just, just tell me below. I don't know. I think it's the mint. Uh, mm, mm. Okay. But that's what it gives me. Watermelon and uh, mojito. Yeah. So, mm. I don't know. We gonna come back to this stuff, okay? Moving on. Next, we have probably one of the ones that I was most excited for with the mashup. And I'm sure you can guess why your sis was excited. And I'm sure you can guess the one I'm about to talk about. If you know me, you know exactly what I'm about to talk about. Anyway, it's going to be the Island Margarita and Vanilla Bean. Uh, yeah, okay. If you're new to this channel, you probably didn't know where I was going, but your sis... Welcome, okay. Yo, sis, love a good vanilla, okay. Vanilla, you know, hair, like you know. Mm -hmm. You gonna know me after a while. It, it's it's pretty easy. I'm not that complex, you know. Cookie cake, candy, gourmands. Welcome, okay. Uh, anyway. It's all hitting me up in the face and everything. This is good. I, I I am going to enjoy this. I love this, okay? This is a part of the love pal. You know, some of the things I've been side-eyeing, like, nah, this is good, okay? Get you this, maybe get a backup. I'm thinking about getting a backup. I'm not quite sure because uh, you'll see. We got a lot to talk about. Okay, so next I have White Gardenia and Tiki Beach, okay? This, I'm thinking that this is going to allow me to smell maybe a 
oak in that type of scent. I'm thinking that it's going to lean like that of what I've known. Um, let's see. Oh, that gardenia is heavy, though. Honey, that white flower is like, bah, poo. I don't know. To, you know, I, Tiki Beach, I, like, where are you at? You in there? You okay? Am I coming in clear? Hey, Mom, I said, am I coming in clear? Because uh, white gardenia is taking uh, taking up all of that. Uh, so we got white gardenia. We have fresh pick greenery. Really? And warm vanilla musk and toasted coconut. Because I was about to say, where's the coconut? <laughs> okay, it's all right. That gardenia, though. So if you don't like a white floral, uh, gardenia, you don't like that, you going to be turned off. You going to be like, this is nasty. P.U. What's that smell? P.U. What's that smell? Um, mm, mm. it's not my favorite. Will I burn it? Yes. Not my favorite. Okay, we got pineapple, mango, and fresh balsam. Okay, now, I love a good pineapple, which is very much in the top. Pineapple and mango. Hmm, the fresh balsam? Can't really smell that part of it. Interesting. So notes we have woodland balsam, fir branches. Um, we have fresh pineapple juice and mango, okay? Again, I'm not smelling the balsam in this, but I definitely smell the pineapple, pineapple and mango, which I love. So I smell more of the sweet than I do anything else, which I'm not turned off. So actually, I love that one. That one is a good one, okay? And then from the blends collection, I call, I, I'll call i call them the mashup. Uh, but we have the Marshmallow Fireside and Black Cherry Marlowe. Um, I don't know. Mm, I don't know. So notes we have toasted marshmallows, crystallized amber, wild black cherries, and velvety red wine. Mmm. Okay, I don't think I like this. Um, I'll definitely burn this, but this is not a favorite. But I feel like this is too heavy for, like, summer. I definitely am not going to burn that. This, maybe I will wait until fall or winter to burn this. Because I think this is going to be more like a fall winter candle because it's a little bit heavy and with that wine. I don't want to say boozy, but you do smell like that um, kind of that syrupy type of red wine in here. And I feel like it's giving me definitely sis burn it fall winter. Okay, so I'll probably be saving this. I don't know if I like that or not. Thinking about that. Okay, moving on. Next up, this is not a blind purchase. I have smelled this in stores. I have loved it, but I have waited. I waited for this moment of SAS to get a discount upon a discount, and then it come into my collection or in my home. Cause I didn't want to get it at full price. What's full price? Twenty six ninety five, and I got this for about like eight dollars. This and some change. No, ma'am, no, Pam. Uh, I'm not about to pay no $26. Anyway, you don't even know what I'm talking about. It's the Santorini Coast. Do you all have this? Love this. Okay? La, 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 love this. This is like where I want to be. Okay? <laughs> Creamy coconut. It is. Almond blossom. Mm-hmm. Warm vanilla. You show is right. Okay? This is where I want to be. It smells like all of that. Oh, this is a good one. If you like almond, ooh, baby, don't hurt them. Now, now, if you burn this, uh, you know what you're doing, okay? You know what you're doing. This is a good one. I, I, 
love this one. Okay, and then next we have Palo Santo and Vanilla, okay? Now, this has Palo Santo, Woody, Must, and Taco Bean. Now, Palo Santo for me sometimes can lean very woodsy, very spicy-ish woods burning-ish in my nose. So I don't know if I'm going to like this. But because I saw the vanilla, I was like, sign me up. Like, how many times you want me to be signed up, okay? Oh, wow. Okay. It's, it's, I like it. It's definitely light. So it definitely smells light. Okay, I can't wait to burn this. I wanna see what this does. It definitely gives me light vibes, but we're in the summer-ish. <laughs> we might as well say it's summer. I mean, it was 90 today. I mean, above. Now, it was like 98. We might as well say it's summer. So, but I feel like that gives me like this wood, but it doesn't like running through the trees in the forest and the woods you know how you know you know how i'd be describing you know we're not running through the there it, it's not that burning but this this kind of sexy she gave me a little sexiness okay i can i might be able to rock and roll with with, with that one okay all right so then next up we we gonna go just left two 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 seconds get give give me just a moment Okay, let's spill some tea. Give me a moment and then I'll come right back, okay? Everything stops for tea. Now, let me tell y'all, okay? Ordering candles online, okay? I don't really have no problems. The only problems I have is when they do stuff like this. Y'all hear that? Oh, hell no. Broken. So y'all didn't, so when y'all delivered it, y'all didn't see fragile on the top of that deck. <clears throat> y'all didn't see fragile on the top of the box. Like you missed that all, it started with an F. You missed that all the way. Like what? Oh, oh hell no. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I called him. I called Bath and Body Works, right? Took my information, blah, blah, blah. Yes, my candle broken, okay? So why did the man was like, oh yeah, we're going to, you know, put your stuff in, you know, so they can review the case. Why I gotta be a case? Is that the standard that, you know, comment down below, let me know, cause I'm new to this. Why I gotta be a case? It's broken. The case is solved. Broken and send me another one. Cause I paid my money. I want the same one. Just send, just send it to me. Case solved. Resolve, you know. <clears throat> Has anybody else had that experience? Like, let me know of the what? Okay, but we'll talk about what this is and what what is. I mean, it is being shipped to me because I did see the, you know. But he just threw me off when he said we gonna we gonna put this as a case and somebody get back, you know, get with you and after they review. Send me my new candle, please. And thank you, sir. And you have a wonderful day, y'all. Okay, what? Warm regards. Okay, dot, dot, dot. Anyway, this was the cucumber melon. And when I say, I'm not going to open this because then you hear the glass. It's going to all fall out. Like, that's not even going to make sense for us. But it's coming, right? But I will say with this cucumber melon that I cannot show you, what sis did, like, this is like, you know, you know cucumber melon, right? She an old school girl, right? She back in the day, okay? She been with us for a time of two, 20, 100, okay? She celebrating her birthday anniversary or something like that, okay? Honey still speaks loud. Like, she was loud through the box, like, Still loud through the box. Like, I can smell her. I'm like, oh, cucumber melon. You didn't come to play. You was like, I'm here. I have arrived. She is loud. So if you have cucumber melon, honey, I know that is filling up your whole space. 
and more. I, I already know. I already know what this is about to give me. Now, if you're not feeling cucumber melon, you like, oh no, Sam, she has to. Oh, I don't like. I, I, I. Like if, if you know you don't like her, okay, cool, cool. You know, then you're not going search past this. You're not even gonna get this, right? This is not the moment for you, right? But those that do like cucumber melon or don't mind dipping back in with a pinky toe back into cucumber melon memory drive, honey, she loud. Pick her up, okay? Cause she's smelling good through this box, but it's broken. Oh, hell no. Okay, moving on. Next, let's go through some of these quick. So we have Among the Clouds, okay? I had to get her. She is all even just cute. She just gives me like, um. My Little Pony, okay? It gives me a little My Little Pony vibe. You know, a little cotton candy, carnival. And that's what it smells like. It gives you happiness, carnival vibes, you know? It's just so playful, you know? I can even see this probably in my daughter's room. But I like it, you know? It's a little kind of, it gives me a little soapy, a little hair, you know, product smell. It smells like a hair product. I ain't gonna lie, it do, but I mean, we gonna burn her anyway. Uh, so we got wild berry skies with vanilla clouds. And that's it. Okay, good. You know, I, I mean, I would, I'm not gonna say go and run and pick her up. But if you like a little cuteness and you got a little coins to spare, you might want to put her on your list. And you might not, you know. Up to you. Okay, but, but, she, but she, clearly she here. All right. <laughs> And then next, you all know. Oh, coconut and sandalwood. Do we have any questions? I mean, those that have been with me, you all know. Um, my new family. Okay, you might not know. This is who I call sexy. Okay, this is this is the sexiest candle. Okay, I have ever burned in my life. Okay, and I, again, I am not a candle connoisseur. So there might be other candles in the world that are sexier than her. You know, you might be looking at me and like, I mean, sis, it is not a niche candle. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is not like popping them all. And all that. Like, this is not, you know, all of the upper scale luxury candles. Like, the take, you know what I'm saying? You might give me that. And you like, you've never tried to tip take. Like, that's sexy. To each his own. You know, I, I, you're right. I have not. But that's why I said the sexiest candle I have ever smelled. You know, that that's why I said that. Mm -hmm. But come on back to me if, if that's where you went for two point. You know, come back. Here we go. Uh, now, this is the sexiest candle I ever smelled. And this is good. Okay. And this fills up your whole house. This is a repurchase on the repurchase. I already showed y'all that I repurchased this again. And then this is the, the backup upon the backup on the backup. Mm -hmm. Questions like this, this is coconut and sandalwood. Go and get that. If you like coconut and if you like sandalwood, if you like sexiness, if you want to throw down on sexiness, you, you want your whole house to smell like a sex bomb. Get this. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this has coconut palm. Luxurious sandalwood, absolutely. Mm -hmm. Warm musk and jasmine, absolutely. Uh, all of that, yes. Get that. Absolutely, get this. Okay, you see this? You you grab it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Moving on. Next, we have golden honeycomb. Okay, do you all know about this? Now, I heard that this is kind of like a creamy type of um, kind of a gourmand. Maybe not, but it, you know, I think it's giving me that vibe. But let's smell. Mmm. Ooh. She's pretty. What you got in you? Uh, okay, so we have savory honey, cozy vanilla, and warm butterscotch that's what that is butterscotch i was about to go to like caramel in my mind butterscotch absolutely Ooh, but this is this kind of gives me light but i hope it burns heavy because this is this is nice i really enjoyed this oh yes okay mm -hmm. 
And then we got white t-shirt. One of my faves. Love a good white t-shirt candle. I have, this is probably the backup on top of the backup. And, and y'all know how that goes. Um, love it. So if you like a linen, fresh, you know. I think this is like, to me, this gives me like, let me turn the label around. This to me gives me like grown white t-shirt. You know what I'm saying? It gives me like, maybe this is a name brand white t-shirt. You know, maybe not the Walmart white t-shirt, but maybe like there's a name brand on top of this and it's a white t-shirt. Like this gives me very luxe, like linen, white t-shirt fresh. I don't even know if that makes sense, but it... <sighs> okay, it just, ooh, good. Okay, so this has crisp, see, see? That's why I'm acting like that. Crisp pear, lavender clouds, soft cedar wood. See? Y'all already know. That's why. Woo! Baby. Love that. Okay? And next we have Rainforest Gardenia. Now, now, I wasn't sure. And I don't know why I got this. And I think I got this more because of the packaging. What color is it? Those that know me, you know. Favorite color? Purple. Sometimes I do that. Look past it. Very immature. Sis, why do you purchase stuff just because of the color? I know, I know. You know, I'm working on myself. Maybe I need to go to a counselor, you know, about the purple phase. Like if I see something and it's purple, maybe I need to talk to a therapist and say, hey, how can I stop purchasing stuff that just because of the packaging is purple? Help me. Help me. Help me. Maybe not, because there might be other problems, you know, a little bit more serious than that one. Anyway, uh, we got white gardenia, we have sweet apple water, we have bamboo and white woods. Okay. Ooh! Ooh. <laughs> oh, that is heavy. Ooh, baby. Y'all better definitely like the woods, the garden. You better like a white fly. You don't like a white fly. You just not going to. You going to be like, uh, what the? Don't get this. Don't don't, don't you blind by this like me. Woo, baby. Woo, that is like white flower and like heavy. What's a white soap? I want my clean as real as ivory. Is, is ivory white? Is a white soap, whatever a white bar soap is, whoo, it gives me white soap <laughs> and white flowers. Oh, I don't know if I like that. Oh, that is heavy. Okay, why well, gotta be in a purple packaging though? Okay, we'll, we'll see. We'll still burn it. Maybe not. Maybe it'll become a Christmas gift. Hmm, let's think about that. Hmm, moving on. Next up, I know I told y'all. I, I told y'all. Mm -hmm. We almost done. Just, just hold on. Get, get some water or some tea, or if it's at night, get some wine. We almost done. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we have Coco Paradise. Mm -hmm. This is amazing. I love the box. Oh, 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 yeah. Ah. Yes. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, I need another one of these. Oh, give me another one. Mmm, a coconut. Mmm, a coconut. Oh, see? <coughs> oh, my goodness. This is so good. So, notes we have salted coconut mani, sugared neroli, and bronze sandalwood. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. This, oh, this makes me, I'm, I want to be on the island. This this reminds me of like Jamaica, like Aunt Jamaica. Like it just get, oh, oh, I need another one of these. Okay, move on. I know, because I, I got, oh, I need another one of these. <laughs> God, this is so good. That's good. Then we have sea salt in the rolly. Okay, let's see. No, I don't know about this. Um, it's okay. 
It don't have me jumping off like that, like the oh, like the coco paradise paradise. It don't have me jumping off the wall like that one. So notes we have for sea salt and neroli are salted neroli blossoms, watery eucalyptus, fresh lemon zest. Okay. I don't know if this is my favorite. I don't know. It's definitely leaning me on soap vibes. Maybe a soap that I don't want. Mm, I'll try it. But it definitely is giving me... I could see like maybe Diptyque. Maybe having a candle like this. And, and, and me not wanting to purchase that candle. You know what I'm saying? Like it gives me a luxe brand, but something that I wouldn't bring home with me, if that makes sense. So I think maybe I don't like it. What do you think? Comment down below. I think I don't like it. No, sir, I don't like it. Mm, we're gonna go with that for now. Um, but I'll burn it to see. I'm not gonna tap it out, but we'll see. Mm. Okay, so we have Radiant Skies, another cute packaging. Gives me My Little Ponies, gives me very girly, very rainbow. Gives me Lucky Charms. The Magically Delicious. Okay, gives me a Lucky Charms, you know, just. Ooh, and it smells like a good Lucky Charms. Ooh, smells like candy and, oh, fun. Oh, this is cute. Oh, definitely burning this. This is like a no-brainer, easy, easy burn, okay? So this gives me rays of sunshine, mm -hmm. makes you happy. Golden mango, okay, mango. Juicy lychee, okay. Okay, mango, I do smell the mango. So definitely a fruity, fun candle. So if you are into fruity and fun and you know, you like a good old Lucky charm. I'm not saying that this smells like cereal, I'm just saying. Like, it, it definitely puts you in, like, where is the gold? You know, is it the bag or the gold coin? I want me gold coin. The pot of gold. That's exactly what it is. The pot of gold under the rainbow. Mm-hmm. Lucky charms. Yep. Moving on. Next up, I have Capri Wave. Okay, I thought that maybe this would give me some aquatic feels just because of the packaging. So I was just trying to throw my pinky toe in being like, okay, let's purchase that. Mm. Mm. Oh, it definitely gives me C, but it gives me under the C. I feel like this is under the sea, like not the ocean, like at the top and you get the scenery. It's like in there with the fish. <laughs> with the fish is swimming. Oh, uh, I don't know if I like this. Okay, this, this reminds me like if I were to go into an um, aquarium, this would probably be one of the scents that would be going. I, I would definitely picture this as that. Um, I just don't know if I want my house to be the aquarium. You know? You know? right um but if you like this let me know like let me know down below does this perform well like this this gives you different vibes when it's lit like i'm gonna light it up right or don't i light it no i'm going i'm going to burn this candle i paid my money y'all know how i am I'm, we're gonna burn the candle <laughs> we definitely gonna burn the candle i don't know if i like that on first sniff mm. It definitely gives me very, very aquatic with the fish, okay? So next we have Blue Bungalow, okay? And I had to, come on, like, Deltas, where are you? Like, where are you at? Are you here? Okay? Deltas, candle, like, elephants. Um, Like, my aunt would love this. You know, my aunt, my cousins, like, they would love this. They are Delta women and they they would love this okay just just for the packaging alone oh now the smell okay oh i'm not messed up with the smell oh it's actually kind of cool oh yeah okay so uh, aunt 
if you're watching, cousin, if you're watching, this this is this is a good one for you to put with your whole collection of the collection upon the collection of elephants that you have in your house. Not putting your business out there, but the, the collection upon the collection of elephants that you got in your house. Uh, anyway, um, this is good. Oh wow. Okay, I don't mind that one. Okay, so this is salted sea breeze. Now this would be an aquatic fragrance of what I'm talking about. This this is my lane. This not so much, but this is my lane. Okay, okay. Salted sea breeze got you. We have beachside eucalyptus. What is up with the eucalyptus? Okay, is that just in everything, the eucalyptus? Mm. And then we got floral shores. Oh my gosh, this is actually, I love this. Wow, I actually love this. This is prop. This, this is a good aquatic. So if you're looking for something aquatic um, and down that range, like I would definitely suggest this. This gives me sweet, but salt vibe right it just ooh. how I might get a backup of this wow I really do like this I actually might gift this hmm interesting all right moving on well that's all that's all family for my massive candle haul clearly I'm done okay that is SAS for me I have wrapped it up I am sealing the bowl and I am putting a lock on that butter bing bang yeah, I'm done. Mm -hmm. All that say, I'm done. Ooh. But I hope you all enjoyed <laughs> my um, SAS hauls. If you did not get to catch my previous haul, which was the body care haul, please go back and check that out. Um, I would love for you to like share me. Honey, share me with the world, okay? Let's reach this thousand subscribers. I would love to get there. Um, but welcome family. I hope you decide to subscribe, give me a thumbs up, comment down below. I would love, seriously, I would love to get to know you and meet you. Okay. And hey, family, hey, uh, uh, family, hey, boy, hey. Okay. And if you knew I break out and dance, it's, 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 love me anyway. Okay. <laughs> Make sure that you are good to yourself. Give yourself some grace. And if no one has told you that you are more than enough, <coughs> what? <laughs> yeah, your sis just did. Bye, family. I love you. Bye.